Perfect, five stars. He's very ugly, perfect for a dog toy. Can't wait for my sweet puppy to rip it to shreds. This review on a streaming mic. ASMR farting is really good on this mic. Mm, the ASMR farting is really good. What was the mic? Blades cut through like butter. Wear the geeky looking gloves. I promise it'll save a trip to the emergency room. Aside from my naive thinking, I love this slicer. It's easy to clean and make salads taste great. Highly recommend. All you need to know. Wish I would have known before I bought it. Carhartt is woke. Oh, okay. Are you gonna cry? One star. Long? Six inches is not long. Uh, check again. Thanos hot one piece 20 centimeter waiting done meme tubby gray blob. God, this is what I'm talking about. What the hell? Don't upset him. Okay, I won't. Found this on a Lego set. One star. Won't know until after Christmas. Christmas gift. Won't know until Christmas. What does that even mean? All hell broke loose. Bought one of these for my house in Texas. All right, this was February 2022. I plugged it and all the lights went out everywhere across the whole state. Yeah, that thing is so stupidly dangerous. Great size, super useful. Loved this little backpack. It was the perfect size for our vacation and day tripping. It was also great to load up for the ER when we returned with salmonella from our vacation. Mark Thorne, four stars. Pizza, great pizza. Eh, looks like a man who knows his pizza. And this is the book's fault, clearly, on a maze book. I thought this was well created and offered interesting choices. Okay, unfortunately, it did not seem to appeal to my seven-year-old grandson who sadly seems addicted to electronic devices. Yeah, you shouldn't be allowed to blame a book for that. It's your seven-year-old. We're in the digital age. Cry about it. Time moves forward. Two stars. Missing pieces. Beautiful, nice quality jigsaw, but there were two missing pieces. Very disappointing. The seller sent another jigsaw to compensate rather than another the same. The one they sent was a picture? I really didn't like. Oh, I see. Duplicate pieces. This is the first Ravensburger puzzle I've bought. Usually too pricey. Good quality, but had two duplicate pieces, which probably means someone's missing them. Not too difficult to complete. One star. Fine. Fine. Was looking at a treadmill on Amazon. Approximately how many coats can I hang on this while I decide to never use it? Oh, it doubled the number of coats and bedsheets that are clean and packed on the rowing machine. And it cleared out the walk-in closet. Now the walk-in closet is good for a small man cave. Up to 300 coats or other clothing. It all depends on the size, weight, climate, season of the coat. For instance, if it were a grasshopper in mid-February, then you might get nearly a thousand of them on it. Now, should it be an elephant mid-February coat? Well, let's just say maybe trying one at a time. One star. Do not listen to the worms. They're liars. I ordered these worms, hoping to decorate my room with them and even make some new friends. Newsflash, it didn't work out. When I opened up the package, they seemed friendly, but the more I got to know them, the more I wanted to return them. Squiggles was the worst one of all. Squiggles kept putting me down, even though I was nice to her the entire time. Do not trust blue worms. They're most likely toxic, like Squiggles. I'm returning these worms because Squiggles said that she couldn't spend another day with me. Unsatisfied. Good, but small. Decent quality worms, fun to play with, too small for the necessities. Wiggle wiggle. I hung these on my ceiling, and now late at night when I'm contemplating my existence, I get to stare at them, subtly wiggle in the dark. Also reacts really well to black lights. Tape. This review was for double-sided adhesive tape. Still got five stars, though. The U.S. Constitution. Canceled my Amazon account because I'm not a fan of big tech and cancel culture. You immediately reactivated your account, guaranteed. Good for popcorn. Great for cooking. Also good massage or off oil. Okay. Why are we yelling? Not what I expected. We'll cancel and get something else. Was not what I expected. Do not like the way it fits. We'll get something else and cancel this one. Okay. I think you're using it wrong. Dodgy side effects. I love this candle. It smelt lovely and had a beautiful crackle, but I had to return it. I woke up twice with black soot in my nostrils. I had burnt it for no more than two hours the evening before. I had to contact my GP. I tried again the next night, but kept my window slightly open and the same thing happened. I have Googled and apparently this is a thing. It was quite alarming and I was gutted because I love it. Also, it left black soot on my ceiling and stained a wall hanging with it. I use scented candles a lot and this has, I can't read today, never happened to me. So must be a fault with the woodwick. I did make Amazon aware, but they haven't seemed interested. So just gave a refund. What the hell? Huh? I don't think you're supposed to shove candles up your nose. I mean, that's not how they work, right? Wait, hold on a minute. I'm, I'm sorry. Were they sleeping with a candle burning? The other images consisted of the frog sitting on a bed and playing VR. 
A perfect 4 out of 10. I mean, the pictures really say it all. When he's not gaming, working, or composing music, he's rocking out to Bumbaleo or... Uh, who? Gypsy Kings? Just do it. Purchase your own distinguished gentleman. There's truly no way to go wrong with them. Who makes coffee in an oven? And using a coffee tumbler? Wait, excuse me? Can I put it in the oven to make coffee? No. Amazon Basics Maxi Pad Poem. What I know. These pads are so big, it takes two jumbo-sized rolls of toilet paper to wrap up. These pads are so big, if Rose wore one on the Titanic, Jack would have survived. These pads are so big that if the Great Flood comes again, I'm building an ark with them. These pads are so big that my bathroom trash is now a diaper genie. These pads are so big that they're dual function. Protection for your period and a pillow for your back. I love sword reviews. Anduril! And so, uh, this is Anduril, the famous Flame of the West, aka the sword that was broken. It was reforged from the shards of Narsil by the Elves of Rivendell. The elfish craftsmanship is pretty good, considering the price. But as others said, this is a display piece. Gave it to my son for his birthday. He loves it. He's planning to use it to take the Paths of the Dead and summon an army greater than any living army. Have fun with that. Ah, kids. Salmon oil? All right, sure. Let's see. Delicious. My buddies and I were doing shots of tequila last Friday night. We drank a lot of tequila. Once we ran out of that, we decided it would be a great idea to turn to the salmon oil for shots. I have to say, from what I remember, it went down as smoothly as the cheap tequila, and I woke up with my dog laying on my chest, licking the roof. <laughs> I think this is how morning breath happens. But two days later, my joints feel great, and my hair was exceptionally shiny. Bottoms up on a $200 gaming PC. Okay, let's see, what do we got here? Hub faulty, computer stuck on screen. Turned on, and this is what happened. Won't do anything, just repeats back to this screen. Awesome. Nine out of 10 Tylers hate this trick. Grout pens. Better than a what? I wanted them to use as a black grout effect on my painted tiles. Tried with Sharpie, however, these were far better. Dries instantly, flows perfect, and didn't run out of one. So these will last me forever. Okay. Sneaky hot plate. Oh, jeez. Wait, is that a turntable? Great for making super secret undercover covert herbal tea at work. This hot plate does what it's supposed to do, but it got me written up at work because apparently hot plates are prohibited in our office by our manager. I was so angry because I need my herbal tea, or I'm literally useless after 2 p.m., so losing my ability to boil a pot of water would totally ruin my life. Luckily, I was able to do some creative arts and crafting, and was able to disguise my hot plate as a record player, so that when I'm not using it, I can make it look like one, complete with a record on top. When 150 rolls around, I take off the record and throw on my kettle to get some me time. Just remember to let the hot plate cool down before putting the record back on, otherwise it'll melt onto it. I attached a picture of my incognito, but I mean, I guess. Yes, but, you know, I think there's a reason those aren't allowed in a lot of places. Ode to a high-powered showerhead. Oh, showerhead, how great thou art, with high-powered spray and soothing flow. Thou bringest me joy from the start of every morning's cleansing show. Thy sleek design and fake chrome so bright makes me smile before the day is begun. And as I stand beneath thy might, all my worries are quickly undone. Thy water pressure strong and true invigorates and refreshes me. And as I stand beneath thy flow, I am cleansed and set free. O oh, showerhead, I am grateful for thee, for thou hast brought me joy and delight. And I will sing thy praises to all who can see thou art a shower head of might. Okay, Shell Silverstein. Star Wars game Q&A. When will the price drop? When Robot Chicken Star Wars is recognized as canon. I admire his dedication. Oh, good God. All right. Mm, let's see. A must-have in your shave den. Use it every time I get off the shower. Doesn't matter if I shaved or not. The feeling your skin has after a quick splash is mood lifting. It lasts for several minutes. I bet a scientific study would prove this product lowers stress, boosts the feel-good hormones, and prolongs life. Get it. It's good for you. Well, now I'm just curious. What the hell is it? How do you confuse a Game Boy with a PSP? Wait, what? I meant to get the PSP. How's that their problem? If you know what you're looking for, you would know that you ordered the wrong thing immediately. Oof, I feel like plastering radioactive stickers on things in the airport should be illegal. Uh, yeah? Radioactive marching band show decorations. Right. I purchased these to give out to our 325 band kids as souvenirs slash favors as they departed Texas for a national band competition. They were a hit. Our use was not the original intention of the manufacturer, so my four-star versus five-star is a reflection of our use only. I thought the stickers were overpriced and too sticky for our purpose, but 
I sure it's necessary for the original intent. I'm not sure the airport thought the same. Yeah, there's gotta be some legality there, dude. Didn't realize the top was as pictured, so I altered to my liking. Needed to alter to meet my needs. Cute top, fits close to the body. Didn't realize that it had the sleeve tabs so that you can roll the sleeves up and button them in place. I removed those as I only wanted it as a long sleeve top. The side ties were also very long, and I decided I didn't want those either, so I cut them off. So it was altered. I really like the top. Okay. Wife loves it. Got this for my wife for Christmas. She seems to love it. She snuggles it literally all night. We don't have relations, so I used to sneak a glimpse of her goods while she slept, but now all she does is cuddle this damn thing all night. I can't win. Just love the energy of this review. I'm five foot four and 215 pounds. I was a little worried only being able to get a large. When I tried it on, instant love. The stretch it allowed was just what I needed. My chunky self and my f*** rocked the mess out of this jumpsuit. Buy it. You'll look and feel great and it'll definitely, or and you'll definitely be feeling yourself. Well, good for you. I was surprised they accepted my review. Aw, oh, what did you say? Uh, like shaving with a rusty battle axe, do not buy this product. I remember the last time I actually tried to submit a real review and they denied it. I said the object was dysfunctional. It didn't work. That's not valid, I guess. Q&A for a satellite phone. Will this work out at sea on a boat? I would assume so, it works off satellites. Remember those gummy hamburger candies? Hell yeah, bad batch. Bun, green, yellow, red, bun. That's the color order. Of my 120 individual hamburgers, one was missing the yellow part. I only got to eat 119 of them because there was one package sealed with no burger. I feel like I should get a few dollars back because this wasn't worth the money. Man, one was messed up. Just one. What is wrong with you? This is how Amazon sends their hard disk drives. So it was broken, right? I mean, I would absolutely have to imagine it's a hard drive. They're not exactly known for being strong by any means. And I love that the review is going to come back incredibly negative when it's Amazon's fault and not the seller. The seller has the item in the Amazon warehouses. It's up to Amazon to get it to its next destination or final destination safely, and they're so bad at it. Bring a squirrel in these basketball shorts. Will I be able to fit my pet squirrel in the pocket? Pet squirrel? That's hilarious, only if it's dead. Might be able to fit some tots in there. These pockets are deep. I don't know how big your squirrel is, but it should be okay. Yes, but if the squirrel has the accompanying spinning wheel, it may get a little cramped. Well, I mean, that's fair. I'm scared for this family. Oh boy. Portable dog playpen saved Thanksgiving. I purchased this pop-up play tent. Play ten? What is wrong with me? As a Hail Mary attempt to allow all of my family to gather for Thanksgiving weekend. Because we have an old grumpy dog who lives to scare children, I truly believe this dog is stealing the life force out of children and using it to fuel her continued existence on this plane. I didn't have high hopes this thing could contain the evil, but the playpen was the perfect solution. Not only was it easy to pop open and easy to fold away, trust me, if I could fold this thing away without foaming at the mouth and cursing the dog who will not die, you won't even break a sweat. But it was also easy to move Satan's spawn through the house to keep her away from the children. I'll 100% sing the praises of this evil containment device for anyone who has a small dog intent on wreaking havoc wherever they go, or to anyone who has a small dog with a loving and kind nature. I hear those exist all though I am doubtful. I mean, this just sounds like a person who couldn't love their dog more. It's like me with my cat. I know he's an evil little jerk, but he's also a sweetheart. Ancient evil spirit. Honestly, horrible. Six foot three, 215 pounds, ordered size 1X. Arrived clean, good stitching. Oh, good stitching, sorry. These break apart real weird. Horrible skirt. Bought this skirt to try out a new color. Quality's good, but the skirt itself should be banished from Earth. Multiple people have tried this on, and it looks bad each time. I'm starting to believe that this skirt might hold an ancient evil spirit that won't allow anyone to look good in it. We all have started bringing gathered fruits and small trinkets as an offering to the skirt, hoping that we could break the ancient curse and release this garment back the outer worlds from which it was crafted. Okay. I would give this skirt one star, but I fear the cosmic repercussions that could arise, so two stars just in case. Okay, it's, it's bad. All right. For a poor cleaning peel-off mask. I was expecting pain. No pain. 
I only got this because all the YouTube videos of people freaking out about how difficult it is to remove. I wanted to see if it'd make my two sons cry. There was no crying. Another weekend ruined. Skin looks and feels nice, though. Yeah, those pore strips? I have used one, not one, I've used multiple. Quite a few over my life, and none of them have ever hurt, but also none of them have ever done anything at all. Like, at all, which sucks. I kind of wish that they worked. I've got horrible, disgusting, large pores, so it'd be nice. They made the game of life sound like the game of death. Never again, one star, disgruntled teenager. If you want to waste money on a game where you can sell your children for 50k a pop, buy the game of life. If you want to play a game where the quality of your life is based on how much money you have at the end, buy the game of life. If you want to have your happiness drained out of your body by an endless amount of ludicrous action cards, buy the game of life. If you want to play a game whose idea of strategy is picking up the two options that have little to no impact on the outcome of the game, buy the game of life. If you want to spend 10 minutes at the end of the trip through hell that is this game doing maths, buy the game of life. Having played it with my two brothers and my mom, we have unanimously decided to give it to the op shop. I feel sorry for the poor souls who, against their better judgment, should buy this game. If you do decide to buy it, please never play it. The only thing it's good for is torturing your enemies or some spare Monopoly money. Monopoly being a much better game, yours painfully a disgruntled teenager. You know the game was bad. You know that person hated the game if they say Monopoly is a much better game. Monopoly is a game that's designed to be pretty much unwinnable. I mean, sure, you may think you won at the end, but not really. Think about your actions that led you to winning, right? You simply drained the money out of everybody else until you were a billionaire and everybody else was homeless or in jail. That's kind of how that works, right? But man, the game of life, I haven't played that in so long. I need to give it another go. Or I'll wait until there's a Scott the Waz game of life. You know what I mean? We've got Clue and Monopoly from him now, so I can wait. Stuffed animal storage beanbag chair cover only for kids and adults. Extra large beanbag without filling. Oh, I see you hid that in the middle. I see what you did. I see what you did there. Cute. Yeah, look at that. Doesn't come with beans. Highly disappointed. I mean, yeah, for shipping, that would have been really annoying. Did not come with any beans to fill it. It's good quality. Perfect for sor storing sort toys. God. I, uh, people, can you try and write your crap appropriately and normally? My brain can only autocorrect so much, and it has a lot of trouble reading people's quickly written and horridly made comments. They're terrible. And yeah, I think it is kind of lame that they did hide that in the middle of these long, stupid, algorithmic titles and names. But you gotta understand, there's no way that a company is gonna pay hundreds of dollars to ship you a full-size beanbag. Another one passing the buck. Or the gerbil. Will this work on gerbils? We've tested our pet wire protector against dogs, cats, and bunnies. We're sure the cable protector gives extra protection against gerbils, too. I'm sorry, I have no experience with gerbils and would not want to advise you wrongly. Maybe someone else reading your request can help, okay? If you don't know, if you don't know the answer, then quit wasting everybody's time by writing out and responding that you don't know the answer. You don't have to respond, you don't have to say anything. I just wasted at least 10 seconds reading your bull- Okay, it wasn't that long, it was more like two or three, but still, you get what I mean, okay? So shut up, sir. Shut up, sir! Of moisture absorber. Talc is a thicker type powder. I say drier, frankly, under my arms. Absorbs moisture well, not an overpowering smell at all. Like it, but be aware it is talc. It is talc, if you're using it in intimate places, it can be a danger. This body talc burns the skin. Oh, well shoot. Found while looking for some double-sided heavy-duty tape. Use with caution. Whatever amount of this tape you're about to use, it's too much. Unless it's something you never want to come off for the rest of eternity. If you've got a mummy's tomb to seal, this is the tape you want for the job. If there's an earthquake and California is about to fall into the Pacific Ocean, the government had better use this tape to keep it in place. Had Abraham Lincoln had this tape in 1860, the South would not have been able to secede. This stuff is so strong, it transcends the physical realm. It'll keep your relationship together. If your boyfriend's about to leave you, just take this out the drawer and show it to him. You don't even need to apply it. Its power is so strong, he'll be unable to leave you. This tape creates a bond that cannot be broken. Use with caution. Teach your wife to be a widow. A wise and comprehensive guidebook for all wives prudent enough to prepare for that time when they may become the head of the family. Okay. I found this book in the glove box of my wife's car along with a length of rope, duct tape, chloroform, and a rag. It was bookmarked at page 17. I figure that gives me about five days to figure out what to do. Damn, I wish this book was longer. A review for a shopping cart. Better luck next time. If you're carrying a box of ghost turds, this item is perfect. 
You had to physically put things on it. Bungee cords were handy. Track is too narrow and wobbly. It will not go upstairs with any ease at all. Bonus gram of tungsten. Sides all meet at 90 degrees, minus a nice, is it camphor or chamfer? Cube, check. My aluminum cube actually weighs in at only 147.8 grams, so I figured some aluminum fishist made off with my extra 1.2 grams of aluminum. That seems the most likely explanation anyway. However, my tungsten cube weighs 1,001 grams. That's one whole bonus gram of tungsten. Look, I'm gonna be honest with you, I didn't know you could get anything like this on Amazon. I knew you'd get a lot of crap, but this? Can't get this in the US. I was really craving some all-dressed chips. Walmart used to sell the Ripples brand in the US, but no more. Finding them online is crazy expensive, and I'm not sure if they'll taste the same or not, so it's not worth the risk. This pack is totally worth it. Get it, try them all out, then you'll know which is the best for you. I think the Ripples are still the best, but boy, was it fun trying them all. I am fat now. I was fat before, but I'm also fat now, too. Yeah, where the hell did they all go? Those Ripples all dressed were the shit. Why'd they stop selling them here? Bro became a philosopher after buying a two-inch cube of tungsten. Again? Not for the faint of heart. If you purchase this cube, I hope you have $2,000 to spare, because all you'll be thinking about is getting the four-inch cube. This thing is insane. At first, one might think 300 is too much for a cube. Then consider that in your entire existence, you've never actually felt something this dense. So dense, you step back and reconsider everything you know about the material world. Normal objects feel tiny and insignificant. The cube will fall in water as if it were falling through the air, and this thing is near indestructible. It'll outlast you and be with your family for generations. This is the ultimate desk item. It is simultaneously an expression and its seriousness and... Wait, hold on. It is simultaneously and expression is seriousness and gravity, comedy, human ingenuity... See, that's what I mean! God! But again, I didn't know you could buy tungsten cubes! Mini babies! 200 pieces, one inch mini plastic babies for baby shower ice cubes game tiny babies baby party favor supplies decorations. <laughs> I like that products can't just be called something anymore. They have to fit the stupid algorithmic bull crap. Five stars, yes. I bought these so I could hide them everywhere for my fiancé to find. At first, he thought it was a charming new bit of mine. He thought I only had one or two of these tiny plastic babies. He thought wrong. Hearing his deep, exhausted sigh followed by, oh my god, because he found number 175 has brought me more joy than I could ever describe. The fear in his eyes when he opens anything because he's expecting a small plastic baby has produced more serotonin than you can imagine. He is a broken man. I have destroyed his hope of living a life free of tiny plastic babies. We'll be finding these for the next 70 years. I will purchase these again. Great book! Couldn't wait to get it in the mail. I'm more than halfway through the book and just got it? The UPS guy asked why I was so excited about this particular order. I explained to him what was in the box. He waited while I ripped the box apart to see Lauren Boebert on the cover of my new book. He said, let me know how it is. Well, I have, and his is on the way. I told him I would share mine. He said that having his own would mean more. W what is this? Y I really don't give a crap.